Hi, this is Sean with Crew Dog Electronics, and I'm going to show you some basic GPS troubleshooting. Here's a common issue that you might have. You can see on the GPS hardware, you have serial port not communicating and GPS solution disconnected. What this means is that the GPS chip inside the unit has been knocked loose, so I will show you how to fix it. So what you do is get your Stratix unit, uh, unplug the battery, and then loosen up the six screws here on the back, which I've already done. Take off the back case and you can turn it over and you can see the GPS chip is just this little square USB chip here on the top. And if this is dropped or knocked, this uh, connection can come loose out of the USB slot. So the quick fix is just to push this back in like that. Make sure it's seated well on that USB connection and then screw this back together and you'll be up and running again. If you would like to kind of fix this and make sure this doesn't happen again. Another thing you can do is apply a little bit of uh, Gorilla Glue to the GPS chip. So what you do here is just take off the cap here with the Gorilla Glue and put a little uh, bead of it up on the top. So can see here right here on the top of the GPS chip just put a little bead of Gorilla Glue let that dry and what that'll do is that'll hold the GPS chip firmly in place even if you have a little bump so after you do that just put the case back on the back uh, put in the six screws and then you should be up and running so turn this over line up the screws and screw it back in All right, got the unit booted back up. You can see we've got the red and green light over there. Uh, and go back to the status page on 192.168.10.1, and you can see this is the normal GPS indications. So GPS hardware, hardware you can see USB, uh, and you've got the name of the device in there. GPS solution, 3D GPS, that's your accuracy. And the satellites, you, you can see it's uh, seen 10 satellites, tracking 11 and it's using six in the solution. So that is the normal GPS indication. If you've got any other questions, please visit the website, crudegelectronics.com. Find us on Facebook, YouTube, or send me an email. Thanks for watching.